everyone, I'm back. Sorry about the little hiatus that I took. I'm not sure what happened there. I'm gonna blame it on Fashion Week. This video is gonna be my August haul and I'm including all my clothing and some accessories as well. Um, I wanna jump right into it because there is so much shit. We might as well start with tops. I am wearing one of the shirts that I got this past month and I'll quickly show you. Yeah. So it's just this tie-dye tee and it's the same on both sides. This top is one I got from the Beginning Boutique sale and it's the um, Oh Mighty Pikamon, 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 <laughs> Pokemon top in the Pikachu pattern. And it's just a little crop top and I swear these crop tops are the best shape and they're so freaking comfortable. Like even though it's been kind of cold, I've been wearing this under like all of my clothes. And I also got the um, same design of crop top. It's a picture of Paris Hilton wearing a shirt that says stop being poor and I honestly think this is the best picture on the internet. I mean, there are a few close seconds but this is gonna be my favorite. All right, so I've been super into um, like the sportswear as casual wear look. I really wanted a a Nike, I don't know, sweatshirt or t-shirt, whatever, with just the plain white tick on it. And it took me so long to find just a plain white one. But I finally found it on ASOS, and it's this baby here. Oh my gosh, it is just such a comfortable t-shirt. And it's just black, nothing on the back, because it's got that sportswear material, so it feels just phenomenal on your skin. From that same ASOS order, I got this top as well. Oh, sorry, it's all wrinkly. Just a basic turtleneck. I don't know why, but I gravitate towards things that are the same color as my hair at the moment. I got this one from Suitcase Rummage, which is a um, little market. Anyway, I sold there a couple times and the atmosphere is just awesome and the clothes are like dirt cheap. Got this polo shirt which is a Ralph Lauren polo shirt and I've honestly wanted to buy one of these for so long but I couldn't justify paying $100 for a polo shirt. When I saw this, I died a little bit inside but I kept my cool and I got it for $5. <laughs> I was the happiest girl in the world. I think we're right to move on to the bottom. This here is a, um, it's called a body stocking. So it's a whole bodysuit, and I know it looks super, super strange, not on the body, but it's actually so amazing. Like this color is just like, wow, it's so vivid, and I love bright colors. It's super stretchy, and it's one size fits all. I just got this off eBay. I have three dresses, and this one here is one I got off um, Chewy's. I could be saying it wrong, my bad. I've been eyeing, <laughs> get it, eyeing. I've been looking at this dress for a long time and I finally cracked and I was like, I need to buy it. Because <laughs> I was really iffy about sizing. I wasn't sure if the length would be okay on me. And turns out the length was not okay. It was way too long. So I have hemmed it myself. Like I had to take like this much off. And it's like a satiny, shiny kind of material. It's got a zip that goes all the way down the back. And this dress here is by Motel Rocks and I got it from, um, off ASOS, it was on sale for like 20 something dollars and it comes in a light dusty pink as well. But I do feel like I own too much pink so I wanted to go for something a little bit different and it's just this blue slip dress. I have cut this one shorter as well because it was really, really unflattering how long it was because it's mini length originally and the back is Amazing. This is my favorite part. It's just got like a crisscross back and it does dip down quite low as well So you should be aware of that. I've worn this to sleep also. I often in winter I sleep in clothes that I'm gonna wear the next day Because it's just too fucking cold to get changed in the morning. It just saves me <laughs> a lot of heartache This is the final dress. Um, I haven't worn this out yet So the tag is still on it, but it's from Misguided. It's a lilac midi dress with awesome awesome mesh inserts just in the bottom like near the knee and also in the waist and the back is a crisscross 
but I'm not sure what I would wear it to because it's quite formal, like the material even feels a little bit formal, but I'm determined to wear it somewhere. To begin for the pants section, I got these ones from Suitcase Rummage and they were too big for me, but I took in the waist myself and now they fit perfectly and they're just gingham pants and they're long pants. They're all the way down and they're high waisted as well and these are so flattering and just so so cute and I think they'll be amazing for the spring weather. And I got these shorts from Suitcase Rummage and they just have little toucans on them. They have little toucans on them. I'm not going to lie, I haven't worn these yet because I'm not sure what I'll wear them with and also it's been too cold. Yeah, mostly it's been too cold to wear them. but. Oh my god, in summer I'm just going to destroy these little suckers. I have, oh, this amazing skirt that I have been, like, lusting after for, like, a year now. <laughs> it's the Oh Mighty Word Art skirt. So it's got, like, the Word Art software screenshots all over it. It's not too short and not too long. It's the perfect length for me, which is so rare in skirts because I'm so small. It's such a great conversation starter and I have a matching top for this as well. It's in the Windows 95 print and together they are just like the bomb. I only noticed this the other day but it's printed on the skirt, like on the kind of side of the butt. It says, then I fuck your bitch. God, that just made my day. And I'll start going into accessories now because I've gotten quite a, well, more than usual. This one here is a cap. Yeah, I don't know if I suit hats. Like, I honestly, I can't really tell if they look good on me or not. This is my personality in hat form. It's like crazy and spastic. I got sent a bunch of accessories from um, an Etsy store called Honey Aura. I got these pom-pom clips for like your hair. She sent me these in so many different colors and I'm just so excited because in spring I'm just going to be rocking the shit all the time. These are my favourite I think. Um, these are like eye clips and in like arts and craft in primary school, that's what these are. And I got matching earrings for those, for these ones as well, which are just the studs. Like, and the last thing I've had stuck on my bag for pretty much as long as I've had it. It's from Orange is a New Black, it's the character Nikki. And it's a badge with her face on it. I think these are one of my favourite things I've gotten this month, this past month. And it's these sunnies from Rara Superstar. They are, um, I think it's a store called Lavender Latte. These are reflective as well. And they have little daisies and pearls on them. And they are clear and pink. I only just got this this morning, but I really wanted to include it because it is such a gorgeous colour. I actually did my toes. <laughs> I was doing my toes right before I started filming in this colour because my nails were already done. And these are fake nails I have on at the moment. They are beautiful, but I could not do anything with these nails on. I had to get my mum to zip up my pants. And that concludes my August haul. I hope you enjoyed watching. And if you did, please like and subscribe. I'll see you next time.